Last month, an Ottumwa man lost his life attempting to swim in the Des Moines River. Just last Friday, the river would have claimed another life if it weren't for the actions of a good Samaritan who rescued the boy from the water. KTVS Maddie Lee talked to that good Samaritan. Uh, we were standing over here in the corner. Uh, we just got here maybe 10, 15 minutes and heard somebody yell help up there and just saw we all we saw was the kid's face in the water underneath the bridge. Tim Bukowski was expecting to take in a summer evening fishing on the Des Moines River. According to Bukowski, so was the group of teenage boys fishing under the bridge until one of them got pulled into the river by something that snagged his line. Bukowski says he has been coming to this part of the river to fish since he was about five years old. All his life, he had been told if you fell into the river right here, you're not coming back out. It was kind of surreal, like, because I didn't think about it until after it was done, and there's a lot of debris and stuff out here. Like, we both could have not came back up. It would have been very easy for that to happen. The ordeal lasted about five minutes. By the time the pair came back up the ladder, the Ottumwa Fire Department was at the scene, ready to provide medical attention. Bukowski says the power of the current left him pretty sore the next day, but neither party sustained any injuries. The Des Moines River in Ottumwa has been rising and is projected to peak at 9.80 feet on Wednesday evening, according to the National Oceanic and Atmospheric Administration. I asked Bukowski what he would say to anyone considering getting into the river anytime soon. Don't swim unless you know what's there. Don't swim in deep water. If you can't touch the ground in the river, don't go in it. And even then, there, there's undertoes and stuff like that that could flip you upside down and you don't know where you're going. In Ottumwa, Maddie Lee, KTVO News.